Miss Tyler, in this presentation, I'm going to teach you a little bit about iron. I'm going to tell you what it looks like, how it's been used in the past, its importance, and show you a couple pictures. Fe. Protons, 26 neutrons, 30 electrons, 26. Atomic mass, 55.845 atomic mass units. Iron is a heavy metal that has luster and a grayish tint. It is the sixth most abundant element on Earth, and it corrodes very rapidly. What are some interesting facts? 1. Iron melts at a temperature of 2,795 degrees and boils at a temperature of 5,082 degrees. 2. Iron is very important. In fact, that anything that has steel in it has iron. Because when iron is combined with carbon, you get steel, which is used a lot in bridges. We don't know the exact date, but we do know that iron was used over 5,000 years ago to make many tools and weapons. Where did the name come from? The chemical symbol came from the Latin word, ferrous. The word iron itself comes from the Anglo-Saxon word, iron. Here are some pictures of the iron atom. On my right hand side, it, the picture shows you that the iron atom has 26 protons and 30 neutrons. Ancient metal workers were perhaps the first to learn about the elements. Gold, silver, copper, and iron were forged in foundries as long ago as ancient times. By 1800, some 30 elements were known, and over the next 100 years, over 60 elements had been identified. As they studied these elements, scientists looked for patterns and how the different elements related together. In 1869, a Russian chemist, Dmitry Mendeleev, published this table of all the known elements. It is the forerunner of the periodic table we use today, and one of the most brilliant insights of science. In the middle of the 19th century, before modern chemistry was established, a number of scientists experimenting with materials came to understand that matter was made up of different elements. They found that some elements were very similar, while others were radically different. What they could not understand was why these differences existed. Solving this mystery led to the development of the periodic table of the elements, which remains the major analytical tool of chemistry.